It was recently confirmed by Paradox Interactive that Star Trek Infinite, a grand strategy game that allows players to assume control of one of the four iconic factions, will receive no further updates, despite of only being released in October of 2023. Following a paltry launch that was punctuated with mostly average reviews, Star Trek Infinite, which was developed by Nimble Giant Entertainment, failed to gain any substantial traction. This is completely unheard of. I, I mean, Paradox probably had $700 worth of DLC behind a paywall that will never be able to be released and enjoyed. In the earliest reviews of Star Trek Infinite, some fans of the franchise spoke positively of the game. There were expectations that it would be a game supported for some time, offering a wealth of potential for downloads, content, expansions. It was described by one reviewer as being the Star Trek game of their dreams. Infinite ultimately failed to live up to the comments, missing the mark compared to competing titles like Stellaris. And the fact that Stellaris already has a Star Trek mod, which is free to play and has way more factions. But here's what Paradox said when it broke the news. Quote, Today we're bringing news regarding the future of Star Trek Infinite, a journey we're embarked on together with a lot of excitement. Sadly, we must inform you that Star Trek Infinite will not receive further updates. We want to extend our gratitude to those who have been the backbone of the journey. To the incredible team at Nimble Giants whose dedication and creativity made Star Trek Infinite a reality, working alongside such talented group has been a privilege. Some fans took to social media to slam Paradox, stating that the last major update for the game was rolled out just two months after the game was released, and since then it has been silent. It's only now that Paradox Interactive has addressed the radio silence, but it's not the answer that players were hoping for. 